SDSN has a unique position as a network of thinkers, of universities, of think tanks, of academics, of practitioners from around the world that are committed and unified by their focus on sustainable development. SDSN has an incredibly important role to play first as a convener of academic disciplines across the board because one of the realities of the SDGs are that they are interdisciplinary and so therefore they do need expertise not just from say the field of economics but from the field of public health, from the field of education, from the field of biology, from the field of chemistry. Bringing all of this expertise together is something that the network structure of SCSN can do very effectively and has done very effectively. Well, the Sustainable Development Solutions Network is a network of close to 2,000 universities all over the world globally. They all have a tremendous capacity of research, uh, science, and they have the possibility of contributing to policy making at the local, national, regional, and global level. So I do think that mobilizing that knowledge, that capacity, scientific capacity, is critical in support of uh, meeting the agenda of these SDGs for 2030. So SDSN will continue to draw the reader's attention to those big important topics so that we can create or co-create the leadership to system change for, for the human being. There is a big role for SDSN from my view. Um, one of them is to put uh, SDGs in many agendas that they are not there yet. There are many um, contexts where people heard about that, but they do not know what to do. SDSN, in my view, can help accelerate by first uh, bringing science to the views and to the understanding of decision makers at all levels, as well as solutions as it has links to those that are like ourselves in the middle of the battleground, trying to come up with solutions. Mm -hmm.